new PlayStation 5 patent, a Nintendo Switch update, a pretty cool Xbox exclusive just launched, and PlayStation Plus just got a banging title today, all in one video. Let's talk about it. That's right, what's up? All right. Before we get started with the video, you already know, give it a thumbs up. The like button is right there, man. It's so close. Just push it, push it. Mm, dun, 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 dun. Push it real good. Y'all don't know about that. Salt and pepper. Y'all young. All right. Um, before we get to the news, though, we're having that $60 digital code giveaway for PlayStation, Xbox, or Nintendo Switch. Make sure you're subscribed and you're following me on Twitter. Let's get to the news. A new patent has been discovered for the PlayStation 5. Boy, that fire boy, Mark Cerny, boy. <laughs> Hey, this conference was so lame. Hey, but I'm hyped for the PlayStation 5 now, man. I'm, I'm just hyped for next gen. Next gen is going to be lit. This new patent is called uh, Dynamic AI Audio. Uh, I'm going to talk about it, and I'm going to share the article that I'm going to share my thoughts. This is coming from Tom'sGuide.com. Sony's PlayStation 5 could use artificial intelligence to configure game soundtracks that will dynamically adjust to the way you're playing and your emotions when gaming. Bro, now we're starting to get a better picture of the DualSense controller and um, how it's going to interact with your, why, why it's even called the dual sense. I have to say, I'm liking the controller design. I, I've said it all the time. Uh, ever since it was revealed, I like the controller design. It's an Xbox controller. Um, um, it's an Xbox and PlayStation controller all in one. The perfect controller. But now I know why it's called the dual sense. Maybe it could sense your heart rate or your how you're sweating, and the game will adjust dynamically. Let's just say. You're playing the game because most games have a set soundtrack for a certain stage or if you're in a battle, a certain soundtrack. Let's say you're on a stage and the soundtrack is playing, but then your hands start sweating. You start getting nervous. Um, your, it could sense your heart rate going up and the soundtrack gets even creepier bro that's some lit stuff <laughs> and so uh, it's called um dynamic this why do i have this um uh, <laughs> playstation 5 event <laughs> in my <laughs> video <laughs> um this could be possibly game changing man how it adjusts based on uh what, what's going on in the game um, they said this Sony's dynamic music creation and gaming patent spotted by Game Rant explains how machine learning algorithms could analyze different parts of a musical score and deliver variations of the music in reaction to how a game is played. The idea is the music will further trigger feelings within a play and help make more for an engaging experience. And so not just and now I'm speculating with the dual sense, but. Let's say like you're tiptoeing in a game, like you're moving real slow and the music changes based on how you're playing. Uh, I think that's dope. I think that's dope. Instead of just having a set soundtrack for each stage, pretty cool stuff. We'll have to wait and see more to it. But PlayStation 5, in a matter of days, we're going to get more information on the PlayStation 5. Can't wait. Can't wait. All right. Next news item, Nintendo Switch. We got an update. 10.0.3 and you want to know what this update does for your nintendo switch absolutely nothing nathaniel nothing 
Um, it just adds system stability, so it's done some background stuff. Um, I would have thought that the system update 10.0, we'd have gotten something big, exciting, great for the Switch. The Switch is so far behind when it comes to um, updates, man. For me, the only thing the Switch has going for it is the Nintendo first party games. It's the only place you can play your Nintendo first party games. But other than that, man, you can't convince me. And third party games run worse. The features are lacking. But um, Nintendo Switch did get an update. I'm not hating on the Switch, bro. I'm just keeping it real, bro. <laughs> um, um, I like my Switch. I like my Switch, bro. But it's just so far behind when it comes to features, bro. Um, but we did get update 10.0.3. Are you going to be picking it up? Let me know, boy. All right. We do have some announcements for free games for both Xbox and Sony. First for PlayStation. This one's pretty dope. Call of Duty World War II is available right now. If you're a PlayStation Plus subscriber, it just became available today, May 26th. So while you're watching this video, keep watching this video, turn on your PlayStation, go to your PlayStation Plus, wherever you get your free games at, and download Call of Duty World War II. Dope, dope, dope game. And it's free. Free with your subscription. That's why a lot of dudes be like, ah, oh, you got to pay more for your subscription on PlayStation and uh, Xbox, but you get a lot of <laughs> good content. On Xbox, also had a couple of dope games. Um, the highlight, um, you get Shantae and the Pirate's Curse, um, Coffee Talk on Xbox One, Xbox 360, Sign, Sin Mora, Sign Mora, and Xbox, The Shore All Humans, the OG Xbox version. So, cool, cool, cool free games for your platform. And last but not least minecraft dungeons has launched today i will be on the game tonight tonight if you're a sponsor if you're a, a sponsor and you want to game with your boy game with the sponsors um every day at least i try to um 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 i'm gonna be on that minecraft dungeons later tonight i got it on my xbox because it's free with game pass so i don't know if the game is crossplay but i will be on it i have to say though the next game i'm trying to beat is Horizon Zero Dawn. Horizon Zero Dawn on my gaming channel. Obi-Wan Plays Gaming Championships. I will be starting a playthrough of Horizon Zero Dawn today. I'm going to try to beat Horizon Zero Dawn and Spider-Man before Last of Us 2 comes out next month. All right. Um, 2020 is shaping up to be a pretty dope year for gaming, man. Um, can't wait, especially for the consoles to be revealed. Get hype. Get hype. Also, tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Sony's having another state of play Wednesday tomorrow. I believe it's 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will be live streaming it. I say this. The state of plays have been lame. All of them have been lame. Except that Ghost of Tsushima one. After that Ghost of Tsushima state of play, they got my attention, bro. I want to see what this Last of Us 2 is all about. All right, dudes. That's it for this video. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sign off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro click that subscribe button stay up to date all things gaming bro we out you still watching this video that means you like me you really like me i gotta hook you up that's right i'm giving away a 60 dollars digital code every month for your platform of choice xbox nintendo or playstation two ways to enter one make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on youtube Two, follow me on Twitter at Obi Wan Plays, and that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash ob one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later. Deuces.